Exhale. Good. All the way up to 10, Marilyn. That's three. Inhale up. Four. Stand your ground. Nice, Gene. I love it. Stand your ground. Five. Elongate the neck, Joe. <clears throat> Six. Seven. Eight. So all this month, my quotes are going to be about your nutrition. <clears throat> and we're going to be doing sit-ups on top of the physio box. This is eight again. So that's the theme this month. Nine, last one, Marilyn. <clears throat> Ten. Good. So now side bend. My hands are inside. Eugene. <clears throat> and I come back up and put that thumb in. And I come back and I still have my voice. <clears throat> but if I don't talk much. Um, well, actually, I'll turn it over to, to Marilyn. <laughs> Five. Five. <laughs> or Gina, you Six. Lengthen. Lengthen. Stretch your body. Exercise. Pilates exercises are so good for your body. You know, I'm serious. One more to each side, Gene. And back. Good. Yeah, I just went to Kaiser yesterday, and I tell you, my God. It's like, I don't want to go back. Left leg forward. The benefits <clears throat> of practicing. See, I'd rather go to, and practice Pilates. Like, I practice... I would say five, six days a week. Aquatic exercises, Pilates here with you guys three days a week. Sometimes in the afternoon, I do a little bit of Pilates also. Monday, Wednesdays, Tuesdays and Thursdays, Pilates for lunch. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let me focus, be serious. Five, match the breath with the movement. Six, and seven, feel the bicep working. Eight, nine, ten. Now I'm going to switch legs. I'm going to reverse the process, Marilyn. Inhale, exhale. Bring those shoulders back. Move your upper back. Move the shoulders. You're on a gym. Good. Inhale up, exhale down, UG six. And seven. And eight and nine and ten. Beautiful. Good. Place the Pilates string on the side. Pull up the man in. Hold your ground. Spread your toes out. Inhale in. Slowly out. For five. For four. You're on it, Marilyn. <clears throat> yes, Jean. Yes, Yuji. For four. And one more, please. Good, right there. Now press the Pilates ring down. Press the Pilates ring down. I like this exercise, like I mentioned on Monday. It works the muscles right on this side. It's right under the armpit. It's, it really shapes, tones that muscle, the serratus muscle, and also the supraspinatus and the medial deltoid. All the way up to 10. This is five and six, Gene, and seven, and eight, and nine, and 10. Okay, the other side, Eugene. <clears throat> so start low. I contract, I go slower on my left side because it's more challenging. Towards the back, bring it towards the back. So what I'm trying to do is not to go forward because gravity is sending us forward. You want to go back, go back. Good. For one, <clears throat> all the way up to five. For two, yeah. For three, shoulder up. Four and five. And now slowly press down. <clears throat> press down. Good. All the way up to 10. Three and four. The legs are active, okay? And five, <clears throat> neck is long, and six, 
and seven and eight and nine and 10. Perfect. Okay, let's work the inner thighs. Hold on to your Pilates ring. Grab your <clears throat> uh, mini ball. Let me drink water. Good. Come up into the atlas. Pull the abdomen in. So make sure that you're not leaning forward this way. Come back this way like that. So the body straight. You want the nice Marilyn. Up. Nice, Eugene. Good. Good. Yes, Gene. Good. Three. Back down. Four. <clears throat> back down. Five. Back down. Six, back down. Inhale, exhale up. Seven, connect with your breath. Inhale, exhale up. Eight, <clears throat> yes, you did. That's beautiful. Nine, one more, please. Ten, beautiful. Now bring it to the front. And now slowly come back up. Yeah, good. Two, yes, Jean. Tippy toes. Three, good. Four, beautiful. Inhale, exhale, five. Six, good. Lengthen through your arms. Seven, lengthen your fascia. That's beautiful, Jean. Eight. <clears throat> and nine. And last one, Eugene. Ten, good. Go here, apply a little bit of pressure to the Pilates ring, and now rotate the neck. For three, for two, for one. Now keep the tension in the ring and gently reverse it for three, for two, for one. Beautiful. From there, without coming up on your toes, we're going to do two sets, Marilyn. Go here without coming up on the toes. One, <clears throat> two. Make sure that your body is straight, okay? Body straight. The ball, you squeeze the ball so the inner thighs are active, the glute is active. The neck is active. Your deltoids are active. <clears throat> Five and back. Six and back. Seven and back. Eight and back. Nine. Yes. And ten. <clears throat> now, um, Jean, come up on your toes. Same exercise. One. Inhale back. Two. Inhale back, good. Three, inhale back. Four, inhale back. Five, inhale back. Six, yes, Jean. Seven, Marilyn, good. And eight, beautiful. And nine, one more. And 10, good. <clears throat> Okay, remove the ball. Let's do the oblique muscle. The oblique muscle is this one. I pull the abdomen in. You go to the side. Come back to center. Good. Come back to the side. Good. Two more to excite Pull the abdomen in. Rotate, rotate, rotate the body. Rotate the body. Squeeze your internal organs. Make them work. One more. And again, one more, please. And come back. Uh, Marilyn, I don't know if this one's going to be, we're not going to rotate. Let's do it the easy way, Marilyn. Go here. Bring your knee up. Good. And now gently the other leg. Come back up. Yeah, go here. Yes, Jean, and contract and balance, working on your balance. Good, I have more balance on my right leg, right? Because that's my normal leg. This is my disa disabled leg. So it's hard for me to balance, but uh, yes. Good, and for extent, good, and extend. <clears throat> good, let's do two more on each side.
Okay, I think you can do it, Jean. Okay, good. So from here, um, Marilyn, so from here, contract the abdomen, go here. Good, now lift the left leg up. Good, and come back. Now bring it here, lift the right leg up. Yeah, Yuji, like that, good. So now to the right side, opposite leg comes up. Good, go here. So if I'm on my left hand side, my right leg comes up. Yeah, working on your balance, Yuji. There you go. Come back this way. Yeah, yeah, Yuji. Up, yes, up, good. One more on each side. Marilyn, you're on it. Yuji, that was it, good. I think Jean went to get something. So she, that was called, the, that's the, the crane stance, right? The crane, the balancing crane is from martial arts, okay? Okay, so <clears throat> let's get on the, on the mat because time is running. And first, yeah, Yuji, my bad, get the ball, please. So first, let's stretch here. Do jeans, stretch to the side. With gentle stretch to the side for four. Yeah, yeah, beautiful, Yuji. For three, for two, for one. No, so watch here, Mar Marilyn. <clears throat> So from here, before we stretch on the other side, we're doing giant steps. So make sure your bottom is towards the floor. Yeah, your bottom is towards the floor. Yeah, good. So lift the right leg. Good, drop it down. Now lift the opposite leg. Yeah, contract the abdomen, pull the leg up, tabletop. Beautiful, Yuji. Contract. There you go. And two, all the way up to 10. Contract, three. <clears throat> contract, four. Contract, five. Contract, six. Contract, seven. Contract, eight. Contract, nine. Contract, 10, good, okay, so now let's stretch the other side, my reading. Okay, Jean, you're back. <clears throat> I got. Beautiful. Hold it for three. Hold it for two. Hold it for one, beautiful, back to center. Now, another variation of that exercise is this one. So make sure your bottom is closer to the, to the mat, okay? From here, I extend a uh, spine stretch, sitting on the physio ball. Bring the legs apart, Marilyn, come back here. One, two, and back. Yeah, Jean, uh, Eugene, two, three, good, four, and five, and six, and seven. So contract the abdomen to come up, Yuji. <clears throat> seven again, contract the abdomen, abdomen now, Yuji. Eight, yes, Jean. Nine, and 10, beautiful. From there, come down a little bit, rotate the neck for three. So drop the, the legs down for two, like a quad, like a yoga quad for two. And now re, uh, reverse it, please. For three, two, one. Now come back this way. My hands go to the outside. Pull up the abdomen in. We practiced this last month. And clap right in front of the chest. Yeah, right in front of the chest. Ready? One. Yes, Jim. Two. Yeah, Yuji. Three. Good. Four. Five, do a little bit more of a crunch if possible, Marilyn. Yeah, here, crunch it now. Yeah, that one. Six, 
Yes, Marilyn. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Now come back down and slowly up. Come back down, slowly up, down and up. So you feel the quadricep working. You feel the quadricep working. We're doing 10, nine, push up uh, with the legs, uh, seven, and six, and five, and four, and three, and two, and one, beautiful, good. So let's do again giant theft. This one is giant theft. And this one, and this one, and this one, and one, and two, all the way up to 10. Bring the leg in, pull the leg in. Yeah, you put the leg in towards you. So you feel the abdomen, uh, you feel the abdomen coming in, uh, five and six and seven, and eight, and nine, and 10, and beautiful, good. So get off the ball for now, and we'll come back to it <clears throat> um, in a little bit. For now, come down, lay on your back, be on top of the fissure ball, grab your Pilates ring, <clears throat> Take the Pilates ring, tuck the tailbone in, pull your toes back, and slowly, this is the move. And back. Slowly, this is the move. And back. Slowly, that's is the move. And back. Good. Up. Good. Contract the abdomen now. You need to come up. Yeah. Okay, all the way up to 10. One and back, two, and back, three, and back, four, and back, five, and back, and six, and back, and seven, and back, and eight, and back, two more, nine, and back, and 10, and back, bring the head down, contract the abdomen, and gently shake your head to the right, bring it back to center, bring it to the left to stretch the uh, uh, neck muscle, one more to its side, abdomen is in first, Yuji, go to the right, abdomen is in to the left, good, one more set, Marilyn, because you're awesome, go here, bring the arms back, pull the abdomen in, contract the abdomen to come up, Jim, yeah, Contract the abdomen to come up. Two. Contract the abdomen to come up. Three. Strong abdominal muscle. Strong uh, hips. And five. This is why mat work, mat fit, so effective. It's good for your body. Seven. Eight. We're going to work obliques after this, Eugene. Ninth. <clears throat> 10 and with control back down. Again, gently bring the head to the left, gently to the middle, gently to the right. One more on each side. Stretch the neck to one side, stretch the neck to the other side. You want to stretch those muscles because they're part of your facial muscles. It's good for your skin glow, okay? Okay, so where am I? So from here, this is from, from last month, Eugene, or actually from, from the month before that. This one, you pull the abdomen in, you take the Pilates ring and you, the top down. This is from, yes, yes, Jean, you're on it. Let's do the same side, okay? This is from about two months ago, this exercise. Yes, let's see, Mary. Yeah, you're on it. Okay, let's do 10 on each side, on, on that one side, okay? One, make sure you guys use your rotational muscles. That means your oblique muscles. That's beautiful, Jean. And three, use the rotational muscles, okay? Four, use core control and concentration. Five, 
Inhale, contract the abdomen. Exhale as you bring the Pilates next to you. I think that was six. Pull the abdomen in, yo, seven. Inhale up, you exhale down. Eight. Inhale, exhale down. Nine, one more, Jane. Contract the abdomen, turn the body, and slowly back. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna, you guys don't have to switch, but I'm gonna switch so that I can keep the eye on you guys. <clears throat> okay, I think this is good. I gently contract, I pull the abdomen in, and I go to the side. Yes, Marilyn. Good. So squeeze your core to come up. Uh, focus your mind on your abdominal muscles. Make sure that you're turning. Turn the body. Okay, good. Okay, all the way up to 10, Eugene. One, Gene. Contract the abdomen. So make sure you guys are rotating, okay? Ugh. Four. Inhale, exhale down. Six. Inhale, exhale down. Seven. Inhale, exhale down. Eight. Inhale, exhale down. Nine. We work the chest after this. And ten. And slowly coming back down. Good. From there, take the Pilates ring. And just the Pilates ring, just the arms. Go here and straight up. Right in front. Have the hands right in front of your chest. In front of your sternum and press out. The neck is long, hug the mini ball, the, the piece of ball in, and then go straight out. Go here, the neck is long, tuck the tailbone towards the front of the body so you have a, a flat back as much as possible, because you only wanna focus on your deltoids and your pectorals and on the muscles of the back. Let's see, everybody's on it. Ready, all the way up to 10. One, we're going to hold it at the top. Two, and three. Inhale, exhale, four. Keep the abdomen contracted, everyone. Five, the Pilates ring is active. Six, work those deltoids, the chest. Uh, seven, eight, nine. Now take it at the top, Marilyn, contract the abdomen, and then squeeze the Pilates ring. My neck is long, hug the ball, Yuji, and now squeeze. And one, and two, and three, and pulse the ring, and three again, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and 10. Beautiful, bring it back down. Good, so next exercise from here, is a similar exercise, but you're doing a checklist. You contract the abdomen. Instead of coming up, you go towards your, um, your knees. Yes, and come back. So now you do a chest lift and you keep pressing, activating the Pilates ring. Okay, so now you're working um, the same muscles you work, but you're doing a chest lift, okay? All the way up to 10, then we do something different. Two, back down. Three, back down. Four, back down. Five, back down. Six, back down. Seven, back down. Squeeze the abdomen to come up. Eight, back down. Nine, and slowly up. And beautiful, good. Okay, have the ball, the the piece your ball to the side, but hold on to the Pilates ring, please. Let me hydrate just a tiny bit. So you take the Pilates ring this way, and you bring it to tabletop tabletop and back down. So this is what we did earlier on top of the physio ball. You come here and slowly back down. So notice that we are doing, we're flexing the spine here. Yeah, Marilyn, flexing the spine. Two, 
all the way up to 10 UG. Contract, breathe, flex the spine forward. So what's flexing the spine is that you're contracting the abdomen. Four, yes, Jim. Five, yes. Good, flex the spine by contracting the abdomen. Seven, I think. Contract eight, the pilates train is still active, so you work the deltoids. Uh, nine, one more, please. And 10, good. So slowly, you contract the abdomen, slow motion. This is what it looks like. Boom. Yeah, Jane. Good, I love your tabletop. And boom. Yes. And one, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down, that's two. Inhale up, exhale down. So if you do these exercises, exercise just one time, one day is not enough. But if you do it at least twice a week, then this is really gonna be very beneficial for you, uh, your physical, okay? And five, back down. You wanna do it at least twice a week in order to see the benefits, to feel the benefits. And seven, inhale, round your back forward. Eight and nine. And after this, we do the clam and 10. Beautiful, good. We do the clam and we go back to the obliques in a minute. From here, let's go back to what we did on Monday, Jean. What I wanna do, uh, Marilyn, this uh, leg stays, uh, is stable. The bottom one is doing the work, yeah. So the bottom leg is doing the work. Good, that will initiate the inside muscles here, your inner thighs, your um, adductors, all the way up to 10, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and be mindful of those muscles, and six again, and seven, and eight, and nine, and 10. Now this leg, do not bring it down, keep it active. Take the top leg and pulse it. Take the top legs and pulse it. So what's bringing my leg down is a contraction in my uh, abdomen. The movement is initiated in the abdomen. And then this leg is active. And then I move this leg with my abdomen, okay? I contract the abdomen is what I'm saying. And two and three and four, and five, Jean, and six, and seven, and this leg is active, eight, and nine, and 10, and slowly, let's do the same thing on the other side. The bottom, the top leg is stable, start with the bottom, good, from the bottom, the bottom starts from the bottom, pull the abdomen in. And one. And two, good. And three. And four, beautiful, Jean. And five. And six. Yes, and seven. And eight. And nine. And 10, now I take the top and I bring it down. Take the top, bring it down. Take the top. Bring it down for two. The bottom one is active for three, four, and five. Work the legs and six and seven, Jean. And seven, Marilyn again. Eight and nine and 10. Now from there, on your back, Eugene, take your Pilates ring. Extend the left leg out and put that thumb in and then turn. Yeah, tabletop, G. Yeah, like that. Here, extend, put that thumb in. Yes, Marilyn. Good. Ready? One, all the way up to 10. Uh, two, contract. Three, working your rotational muscle. Make sure you guys contract the abdomen and you keep the ring somewhat active. And four, the ring is somewhat active, okay? Five, oh, six, 
We're combining two of the exercises we practiced already, seven, abdomen is hitting you, G. Eight, inhale, exhale, Joe. Nine, last one, 10, and the other side. So I pull the abdomen in, extend the leg, slow motion. That's what it looks like. Beautiful, G. And Abdomen is in, squeeze your core, one and back. Contract, two and back. Contract, three and back. Notice that we're also rotating your upper back. So this is working your upper spine and five and back. Work with the breath and six and back. And seven and back. Ish. Eight and back, nine and back, 12 and back. Now take the Pilates ring, place it between the inner thighs. Hands behind the head, pull the abdomen in. This time you do the clamp, but you keep the, the hips down. Come back up, you do a chest lift. Yeah, do a chest lift. Two, chest lift, three, chest lift, four, chest lift, five, chest lift, six, abdomen is in, Marilyn, seven, your core is in, eight, and nine, and 10, and slowly back, beautiful. Take the left leg, bring it up, on the hand grip, hands on, my hand is on the outside, put the abdomen in and come back off and work those muscles again. Two, Jean, contract, three, inhale, exhale, four, inhale, exhale, five, contract, and six, contract, Seven, contract, eight. We're gonna do the next side after this. Nine, and 10. Gently the other side, underhand grip, activate the bicep, work it, yes. Work the obliques. There you go, Mary. Good. Lift the shoulder blade off the, you got it, Gene. Lift the shoulder blade off the mat. Ready? One, and back. Two. Lift the shoulder blade off the mat like you're going across. You're reaching across the body. Three, work the abdominal muscles, work the internal organs, make them work more efficiently. And five, inhale, exhale, six, inhale, exhale, seven, and eight, and nine. We work the inner thighs after this. Ten, good. From here, before we do the exercise, go here and stretch, please. On the side and stretch. Extend the other leg and stretch, yeah. And stretch for five, four, getting a cramp, three, and two. Good, the bottom leg is active. Yeah, Jean, good. Now from here, let me see if I can remember this exercise. From here, actually, yeah, let's do it this way, like that. Let me do it this way. I think it's gonna be easier for me. So from here, so on the, on, on the top, Marilyn, the, your legs are on the outside. Marilyn, the legs are on the outside, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yes, yeah, right. Perfect, Marilyn. <laughs> yeah, I was going to do it that way, but then I figured, no, that's going to be challenging. So from here, what I want to do, so I want to work, go back to the inner thighs. So my, I'm lengthening through the bottom leg, and now I'm pressing on my top leg. So let me see. It's okay. Actually, so we can do it the easy way. Not, well, not so easy. Is to keep the bottom leg down, right? And then just work the top leg. Just work the top leg. Just work the top leg and then we do the other side because 
if the other leg is act this way, that, that's, a, that's a little bit more challenging, okay? And it's still, um, it's still Wednesday, stored in the week. Okay, so point and then slowly 10, okay? One, contract the abdomen to press down. Contract the abdomen to press. Press and four and five and 16 and seven and eight and nine. Let's do one more set. Press, pulse it, pulse it, pulse it for 10, pulse it for nine, for eight. This is really to, to really tone, elongate the muscles and to make them nice and strong and active. And where am I? Five, pulse it, and six, and seven. Yeah, and eight, and nine, and 10. So it's really good work for the inner thighs. Okay, do the other side, Yuji, please. So my legs are on the outside. Let me see. Yes, so we can do this. Good. Point. Kind of hard to get it in place. Jean, yeah, she's on it. Good. Like that, Marilyn. Good. So make sure your body is nice and straight, everyone, okay? And slowly press down. Slowly press down. So the bottom leg is active, okay? I have it on the mat, but it's active. This is a good exercise to tone the legs, guys. Good. Tone your awesome toe. One. All the way up to 10, Eugene. Two. Three. And then we're going to pulse it 10 at the top. And four. Inhale, exhale when you press down. Inhale up, exhale when you press down. Inhale up, exhale when you press down. And six, inhale up, exhale down seven. Inhale up, exhale down eight. Inhale up, exhale down nine and 10. And now here you're gonna pulse it, pulse it, pulse it. Similar to the exercise you guys did earlier, pulsing the Pilates ring, you pulse it now with the ankle joint and one and two, and three, and four, and five, Ooh, ah. and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and 10. Beautiful, good. I think I forgot to stretch your leg on that side, but that's okay. Um, So let's go back on, on the physio ball. And I know I'm forgetting something. <coughs> I'm not sure about, but I'm forgetting something. Okay, let's get the, let's do your, your 100 reps, okay? To get you guys nice and strong. Oh, I don't know, I was gonna work the triceps kneeling down. We can do it um, Friday or some other time. Okay, let's do it on the physio ball. So go here, lean slightly forward. Go here and back and back, uh, 20. Ready, Jim? One, two, three, four, good, Eugene, five, and six. Nice, 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 I love it. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10 more, 11, good. Nice, nice guys. 12, I love it. 13, 14, 15, and 16, and 17, and 18, and 19, and 20. Good. You know, if I have people like you at Kaiser, I'll be there every day, man. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Slowly up to the eagle. Good. Oh, good. Three, 24, good, 25. This is a good exercise to strengthen your postural muscles. 26, Jim, yeah, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, contract, 32. Inhale, exhale when you come up. About 36, 
37, work those beautiful deltoids. 38, 39, 40, work the front. Stick toward the front, pull the abdomen in. This one, Yuji. Good, flat back, okay? Keep the back flat and the abdomen is in Gina and Marilyn. Uh, 42, 43, 44. Take your time. Uh, if you take your time, the muscles will, will work harder for you. 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, and 56, and 57. Good, good, good. Love it. 58, 59, 60. Good. The next one is the zipper up oh, in the front. We have not done the zipper here in the last week or two. Go here, pull the abdomen in, you're on a UG. This is a great exercise. I like this exercise because it's good for the chat and for your um your um your deltoids, your shoulders, and your upper back. 65, 66, and also because you're holding the weight, so it strengthens your wrist. 67, 68, yes, Gene. Yeah, bring the elbows out if possible more, Marilyn. Elbows out, yeah, like that. 71, like that, Marilyn. 72, yeah, because that will hit the upper muscles on your upper shoulders, yeah, there you go. Uh, about 75, I think. <clears throat> 76, like that, Marilyn, you're awesome. Yes, Eugene, 77, ah, 78. Yes, Jing, 79 and 80. Now, to complement everything is the atlas, right? That, comp that works the biceps, the triceps, the deltoids, the upper chest, and the upper back. So I lean slightly forward, and I pull the abdomen in, <clears throat> and I come back up, and I do 81, 82. So this is to enhance all this other movement we just did. 84, 85, contract, yes, nice, nice, I love it, beautiful, flat back, guys, I love it, good, perfect, 86, yes, yes, you're training your back to be nice and long, good, 89, inhale, exhale up, 90, last 10, 91, inhale, exhale, 92, yeah, lengthening up, 93, keep lifting the upper torso, 94, 95, Jean, you're awesome. 96, 97, 98, two more guys. 99, inhale, exhale. 100 with control, bring it towards the front and you can let go of that. Hands on your knees, pull the abdomen in, rotate for three, for two, for one, and gently reverse for three, for two, for one. Beautiful, good. So from here, let me see if I can think of doing the, yeah, I think we can. I think we can do the gate pose. So be careful. We're doing some kneeling work this month, so I'll introduce just a little bit at a time. So you can do the, the gate pose with uh, the feature ball. So extend the ball some more, Jean. Extend your ball, yeah, so that works more. Extend, good, good. So one knee, only if it's possible, one knee forward. If not, yeah, it's like a runner's pose. Hold it for three, hold it for two, and I contract and I come back this way. So only if it's possible, I'm gonna bring the camera down. Yeah, you did, yes, good. So from here, I contract, I walk the ball away from me. I pull the abdomen in, there you go. Oh, lengthen through the ball, good. Yeah. Hold it for three, hold it for two, and hold it for one, good. The reason I'm doing this exercise 
One is because I want to help you guys. I know this is hard on your knees, but it's, it's to help you to do something different, okay? But then the second part is something called proprioception. It helps you guys. Proprioception is about how do you feel your body in space, how you move the body. So by trying new things, then that challenges the mind. So from here, you want to walk the boat. This is spine stretch, which you guys know, I'm gonna show you sideways. This is spine stretch, you go, you walk the ball forward and you hold it. This is spine stretch. Yes, Jim. Yeah, spine stretch, kneeling with one leg up, right? With one tabletop. So you're stretching your upper back. Hold it for three, hold it for two. Hold it for one. Now put the abdomen in and bring the ball back. So, you know, the ball is very unstable, right? That's the point they call it the stability ball. And so it, it is challenging the way your body experiences movement, okay? So you go here. My right leg is forward now. And I gently walk the ball forward and I do a spine stretch. Yeah. Nice, Marilyn. Yeah, you're on it now. Yes, Jean. Yeah. Would you? Yes. Hold it for three. Hold it for two. And hold it for one and bring it back. Good. Okay, so let's get down on the mat. We will continue with that exercise this week, okay? We're going to sharpen it up a little bit. So the exercise we just did, Eugene, was this one, right? Hold it here like that. This is the exercise we did, right? Just now, except we're sitting. So sitting, this is, you guys have this down pat. You guys have this. So the idea to me is like, okay, so what else? How can I challenge you guys? How do I challenge your, your body, right? Your, your, the way you're moving. So kneeling with a stability ball is what I thought about. <laughs> And I come back. Good, always looking for something new, okay? But no, you don't seriousness. It don't help with your proprio section, okay? And long term, short term is hard. Long term is gonna be beneficial. I put that coming in, and you guys already know this one. This is my Taekwondo yoga um, side bend. Hold it for three. For two, and pull the abdomen in. We have about two more minutes, Marilyn. Now, you take the left same leg, Marilyn, go here. And now figure four. And I turn, wanna turn my shoulder toward my leg, um, yeah, toward my leg, inhale up. And I contract the abdomen. This exercise is to stretch the back of the leg and your low back. And you guys wanna hold it, you're awesome, um, Jean. Marilyn, yeah, for three. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And slowly back, good. So before we do the taekwondo, the side stretch, right? Do the, do this one again. Marilyn, be careful with your knee, right? At least for me, that helps when I have one here. My shoulders are forward, inhale up. I contract the abdomen, dorsiflex, bring your toes back and pull back, nice, beautiful. I love it, man. Hold it for four, for three, for two. Four, one, and I slowly want to walk my hands back, Eugene. Now, let's finish it up, Marilyn. You go here, put the abdomen in. I contract, be careful here with your back, with your spine. Careful with your spine, everyone. Careful with your spine. There you go. Yeah, good flexibility, Gene. Yeah, there you go. Hold it 15 more seconds, guys. Keep your abdomen active, please. Hold it for three. Hold it for two, hold it for one, come back. So another way of stretching the spine is to flex it, right? But this time you got one hold that you want to come back in your here and slowly come back and make it straight again. We're looking for spine flexibility. You inhale back, Marilyn. You exhale out. And one more, Jim, inhale back. Exhale out. 
Good. And the other one we did on Monday, uh, Marilyn, this one is is a hip opener. So your feet are together. This one is from uh, Yenga Yoga. <clears throat> I pulled up coming in and I want to bring the edges of my feet together and I want my back straight. There are two variations. One is leaning forward and another one with mm, spine straight. So let's do it with Pilates spine straight. Hold it for three. Keep lengthening, pressing your feet together, especially the edges of your feet. When you press your edges of your feet together, um, Jean, the knees will have a tendency to go down. So if I when I press, look what happens. My knees go down. And that's what you're looking for. Like that, Eugene. And back, beautiful, good. Now from here, the last one, this is from Hatha Yoga. You come around slowly and doing three on each side. It's almost like you're dancing and you limit the range of motion. This movement is very small. And the abdomen is almost like um, the snake dancing. One more. And now uh, gently you reverse for three, for two, and one. Good. Inhale up. The back is straight. Exhale down. Abdomen is in. 